April 24 commemorates the systematic genocide of 1.5 million fellow Armenian Christians by the Turks between 1915 and 1923. During this time, up to 2.5 million Greek, Assyrian and Armenian Christians were massacred in the dying days of the Ottoman Empire. The Armenian Genocide, often called the first genocide of the 20th century, was the event that later coined the term genocide. And yet, to this day Turkey still refuses to acknowledge it as such. Christians were rounded up, tortured, burned, starved, raped and sent on death march through the Syrian desert. Many were crucified. Many of these horrifying events later went on to inspire and were replicated in the Holocaust. In 1939, Adolf Hitler made a chilling remark, after all, who remembers the Armenians? A century later, the Christian population of Turkey has been reduced from 20% to 0.2%. In a cruel twist of fate, Armenian and Assyrian Christians whose ancestors fled the Ottomans to Syria and Iraq have been forced to reverse their exodus. ISIS has driven out over a million Christians from the region in only a few years. Armenia is significant to the history of Christianity. It was the first nation in history to officially adopt Christianity as its religion in 302 AD not shortly followed by the neighboring kingdom of Kartli and the powerful Ethiopian Empire. All three nations adopted Christianity over half a century before Om's official conversion. Interestingly, all three remain the only lands outside of Europe to resist Islamization and retain their Christian identity into the 21st century. In every other formerly Christian land of Africa and Asia, Christianity was either reduced to an extreme minority or completely wiped out by the 16th century. Today, while Protestants and Catholics dominate global Christianity, it was the Assyrian Church of the East that held this honor from the 5th to 14th century. The church stretched from the deserts of Syria to the port cities of China, the frozen steppes of Siberia to the tropical coasts of southern India. Assyrian and Armenian Christians were fundamental in first introducing Christianity along the Silk Road, but tragically they remain some of the last remnants of this once great history. After Christianity was annihilated from Central Asia and China by the Muslims and Ming Dynasty in the 14th century, the story of the Armenians and Assyrians, and also the Georgians and Ethiopians, is one of resistance and perseverance against their successive Roman, Persian, Arab, Turkish, Mongol, Somali, Sudanese, Russian and European invasions. They have endured much loss, but they are proud of their history and unwilling to compromise their faith.